Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add an image to your video using Filmora Tense. And I will show you some more tips and tricks uh, to do with your image uh, in Filmora 10. And you know that I have already uh, published a tutorial about Filmora 9 over here, so you can watch it if you want uh, one. Uh, now we are in Filmora 10 and we can do some more things with our image. Uh, by the way, so let's go to the screen, okay? Uh, so here I am uh, in Filmora 10. In order to add an image to your video, all you need to do is to click on this button. Or you can just drag and drop your image uh, directly to this area when you add the media folder, okay? Uh, I will drag and drop because it, it is much faster. Uh, let's say here I have some uh, image of me. So uh, this is in uh, JPEG, uh, but remember, Filmora 10 accepts JPEG, PNG, uh, GIF, uh, TIFF, or, or some, some um, image format that uh, you need to see or hear, okay? So let's just uh, drag and drop this image into Filmora 10, like this. Okay, the first thing, we need some video, right? Okay, we go to uh, sample video and here you are. Uh, so I, I will use the sample video right inside Filmora 10 so that I don't need to uh, to import anything. Uh, we will drag and drop it to the first track. And now we have this uh, one. Uh, nice, right? Now we will want to overlay an image uh, over here. So go back to folder. And okay, this uh, image, for example, let's drag and drop it right here. Okay, so now you have the, uh, the image uh, on the timeline on top of your video. Now you can do uh, something more with your image, such as uh, how to transform it and uh, how to add a border for your image or how to add a shadow for your image or using different blending options also. Okay, I'm going to show you. Uh, if you want to uh, transform, so just scaling uh, the image or rotating or something like that, you just click on the image on the preview window. And then you can uh, left click here uh, to resize resize the image or to scale it down, okay, uh, like this. And then you can also uh, left click on the image and then uh, hold your mouse and move it to anywhere on the screen. Uh, that is very interesting, right? And you can also rotate the image like this. The, this action called transform. To access to your transform tab uh, of your image, you just need to double click on the image double click on it and here you see uh, your image probably we have uh, image color and animation so the image is all the basic things like transform compositing and chroma key and um, drop shadow and uh, and and something more but to uh, transform the image you can see here uh, it is checked so uh, we can click on this uh, drop down menu uh, here we have the rotation right rotation we can rotate the image like this and we can also flip the image horizon, uh, horizontally or vertically like this and this and also we can scale up or scale down the image right here with this slider nice right and adjust the position okay so that's how you can transform your image uh, right inside Filmora 10 and you can also reset reset uh, all the uh, all the, the parameter in this uh, transform box okay click on this button and this button this button to reset okay it's just uh, flip and then we can uh, like this nice right so that is about the transform and how about uh, blending option uh, we have 15 uh, different blending option in Filmora 10 we can use for our image or the same with the video. So here we have the compositing tabs, uh, which is the uh, blending option in Filmora 10. We can click on this drop down menu. And for example, here we can uh, select one blending mode for, for our image, such as overlay, overlay like this. Yeah, and, and you can create a, an effect like this, a ghost effect or something. And you can also adjust the opacity uh, at this slider of the image. So this is very nice uh, when we have blending option in Filmora 10. We can use it with our image, right? Uh, let's preview it. Ooh. Ooh. Nice, right? And uh, of course, uh, at, the, at the property panel, we have here some uh, something more, such as the chroma key. You can also apply the chroma key for your image also, because this is similar to 
uh, to a video. And here we have a color. So you can also color correction your image uh, like the way you do with your, with your video. Uh, we have the basic here and uh, we have the advanced color correction tools uh, of your image right here if you click on this advanced and finally we uh, we have animations so this is the new feature of Filmora 10 you can add animation keyframe to your image or video using uh, this software so for example this is the image uh, if I want to add a keyframe for that I just go to here click on the customize and then I can add a keyframe that is the first keyframe and go to the second uh, second position of the uh, of the image uh, then I can add another keyframe right and just adjust the image scale it down right okay so it's look about uh, look like a ghost so I'm going to uh, blending mode again uh, I'm going to uh, turn it to normal uh, so that you can see the, the effect better okay and let's play it that's nice right and remember you can also add video effect or add image effect so it is in the effect tab here right here uh, so you can add borders and uh, also other effect just drag and drop them directly to your image right uh, like this go to the utility and add a border for your your image so it will have a border around your image and we can also go to filter and check and then we can add a shake effect to your image like this That's nice, right? So there's so many things more you can do with your image when you uh, you add it to your video using Filmora 10. But uh, this is a basic tutorial. So uh, I hope it is helpful for you. If you have any question, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.